remarkable the number of local baseball players who are in the pipelines of Major League Baseball right now. Working hard to live out that dream and get out of this weather and make it to <laughs> play some baseball season. Scott and Lisa, Tommy Reisinger was all PSAC East first team for East Stroudsburg University. His 200 and career, 202 career strikeouts are six most in school history. Steve Lloyd shows us where he's headed next and how he's been on the rise since high school. Tommy Reisinger's path to pro baseball began at Mount Carmel with a mix of sports between basketball, baseball, and being the quarterback on the football team. It was a ton of fun for Tommy and kept him busy playing multiple sports. Once he settled on playing baseball, the college experience began at East Stroudsburg, a four-year career there, and most recently, the Oakland A's 10th round draft pick last June in the Major League Baseball draft. I actually didn't realize they, had, they were interested in me until a week before the draft. Uh, Chip Falk called me up. He's like, hey, saw you at Pro Day and two other days when you were throwing. I uh, really liked your stuff. It looked electric. A day before the draft, he's like, hey, uh, be by your phone. We're going heavy pitchers. And then he's like, how much? He was going over financial stuff, stuff like that. And I was just like, told him what I wanted. And then they picked me and then he called me and dream came true. Racinger still travels to Monroe County to train. He leaves March 1st for Arizona with the beginning of spring training. Coming out of high school, I didn't really get recruited by any big schools. It was mostly D2, PSAC, stuff like that. So, I mean, when Coach K came and offered me the, the scholarship down at the field, I was 100% in from the jump, and I came here. He was talking to me in his office saying there was a picture up on the wall of people that got drafted here, and he's like, I see you being one of them one day. You know, when he first got here, you know, he, he was super, super talented, but didn't really um, – know where the ball was going, the speed of the game and everything. And, and, but he was the hardest worker that we've had. And then he just kept getting better and better. And then his junior year, everything clicked. And, you know, he was borderline unhittable. Racinger wasn't the only Mount Carmel baseball player drafted. In the ninth round, the Nationals selected Thomas Schultz out of Vanderbilt University. Schultz and Reisinger were teammates for the Red Tornadoes. Crazy. I mean, Thomas, I mean, it's like he was destined for it. Right from the jump, he was going all over the world, playing, competing at the highest level, and then going to Vanderbilt, which is, again, is the highest level you can compete at. Steve Lloyd, Newswatch 16 Sports, Monroe County.